Vice President and General Manager Bob Cook. We've all seen the trashy, unsightly, homeless camps that have sprouted up all over our city. This has become a major problem that's just getting worse. Camp dwellers include the working poor, the out of work, and the mentally ill. Preying on them are drug dealers, gangsters, and criminals. Even though voters just passed two tax increases to build 10,000 units of homeless housing, still completion of those units is years away. In the meantime, the number of homeless will continue to explode if the past is any indication. The homeless population in Los Angeles rose 75% since 2010 and grew 23% from 2016 to 2017, totaling nearly 73,000. Clearly, something has to be done, and done quickly. In October, City Controller Ron Galperin suggested some worthwhile solutions in his report on homeless encampments. The controller wants the city to open emergency campgrounds and shelters. Recently, San Diego did just that. The city felt it had no other choice. The homeless situation was so out of control. Make no mistake, LA is at that point. There are 191 homeless encampments in LA County alone. Nearly half these encampments are in high risk fire areas. Retiring police chief Charlie Beck stated, lessening the homeless population will dramatically reduce crime in our city. We cannot leave these things as they are, considering Los Angeles has the highest proportion of homeless in the U.S. and is growing rapidly. The report on homeless encampments recommends that the city immediately utilize municipal-owned properties to create temporary shelters and encampments so that these large tent cities could be shut down with their inhabitants having some place to go. Homeless encampments represent a myriad of severe community risks and are growing out of control with no end in sight. There's no time to waste. We need to move these homeless encampments to municipal-owned properties, then properly police them and do our very best to provide electricity, water, and sewer drainage facilities. The mayor and city council need to act on these controller reports and create these controlled encampments, and they need to act on it now. Thanks for listening. I'd like to hear your point of view. Go to foxla.com and click on POV, or email me directly at pov at fox11.com.